Hello and welcome to a new episode from Zyxel Support Campus. Today I want to introduce to you the WAX640S, which is a 6E triple radio module access point. So it can send out three different SSID in three different frequencies. This device can be used as a Nebula access point but also can be managed as standalone. Let's see what is inside the box. The device comes in an eco-friendly box that consists mainly out of cardboard. It contains the user manual, warranty card and FCC declaration in a PE bag also the device with a polyethylene cover that protects the device during installation. On the cover there is the MAC address and the serial number of the device which you can use during the setup process. On the back side you can find the device information and under the cover you find the power socket, the uplink and the LAN port as well as the grounding. Also you can find a bag with screws and plugs for concrete mounting or dry mounting and the mounting plate with different holes. Please note there's no power supply included so you have to buy an extra one or use a PoE switch. To install the device you need the Nebula app which helps you in four steps to set up the device for your organization and site. Let's see how this works. This installation video shows the equal installation for all Nebula access points. You need an account to the system, log in with this account, then you create the site, register your product to this site using the QR code on the boxes or the device, and the device will go online after you installed it ready for internet access. With the Nebula app or the access to Nebula control center with a PC, you can manage your devices from out the internet wherever you are. Your access point is ready in four simple steps. You can also use the device as standalone, which is a little bit more complicated, but the quick start guide, which you can download from our internet site, can help you to follow the steps. Let's see how this works. Unpack the device and make it ready for installation using a separate power socket or a PoE switch which is connected to a router and the internet. Then the device sends out a Zyxel and the four last digits of the MAC address. Connect to this network using the HTTP address shown and the connection admin and the password 1234. This is only working in the first installation. After that you can set up all separate things on the website of the device. For any questions visit us on support.zyxel.eu. You can find more than 700 help desk documents in different languages and contact to our support. I also suggest you to subscribe to this channel so that you do not miss any of our new episodes. We are done with our episode, thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so that you do not miss any of our new episodes. Also you can follow us on Facebook. If you are a Zyxel reseller, then visit the partner site under partner.zyxel.eu. Thank you very much for watching, have a nice day. We're Zyxel and we're your networking ally. Do you want every video that Cycle offers for unpacking and setup? Then subscribe to the channel and do not miss any of our new episodes.